So here we are. It's the next morning. I didn't get very much sleep. You can tell on my face. Look at me. Uh, yeah, you know, I, I was stressing out all night, and that's because the first 24 hours are kind of critical because if you, you know, didn't do your planting right and, you know, your due diligence, stuff can become uprooted in the first 24 hours. So because I woke up and there's no floating plants, I know I got them in there, you know, solid. Um, all kinds of things are going on in here. Some Amazon sword, uh, red undulata, uh, so, uh, cardolinas. Um, there's also um, uh, bacopa, um, repens, uh, green cardinals, you know, so obviously a few floaters, um, the small stuff is um, dwarf uh, dwarf water lettuce. The bigger stuff is, um, I'm sorry, frog bit. Um, it's still still gathering my thoughts and enjoying my coffee and my job. I know it doesn't look like much over here right now, but um, these are all going to fill in, f fill this whole area up. Um, the stuff in the back. Our, our stem plants are going to grow uh, long, thin, and tall, and then um, uh, these other plants like the uh, undulata and the cartilinus, they're, they're, they're bushy plants, so they're going to grow like outwards instead of upwards. The Amazon sword will grow tall. There's one random piece of hornwort in there. Don't ask me how I ended up with one random piece, but I have one random piece, and uh, I'm actually still not done. Um, <laughs> You know, I, I was just so excited to put it together, but this over here, this is driftwood. I boiled that driftwood for 14 hours, uh, it, uh, li literally 14 hours, like, you know, all day and all night, changing the water every hour, and I still could not get all the tannins out, and what, you know, what, what that is, is, you know, if you put driftwood into a tank without boiling it and removing all the tannins... It'll turn your water brown and murky, which isn't bad for the fish. And some hobbyists like like brown water because they think it looks natural. I want everything clear. And fortunately, what I'm doing with that driftwood is I'm going to be adding, I'm going to be tying some uh, Anubius and uh, Wisteria and uh, different types of Java fern to them. And I can put those in any time, you know, so... Uh, no, there's not any fish right now. There will be uh, eventually, but I need it to cycle properly. I'm going to let the plants fully grow in so when I, you know, for a couple months, so when the fish do get in here, they have stuff to swim around and look at, you know, and I made a little fun bridge with the beach area going through there, as you can see. Um, and I, I want to thank my dad for uh, some help. Um, uh, I am not a wealthy person. Um, uh, you know, I don't want to turn it into a sad story, but I'm losing the ability to use my hands. And this is what I'm doing with my spare time while I'm at home on disability. And I have to buy everything piece by piece. You know, um, after mortgage and bills, one month I bought a tank. One month I bought a stand. One month I bought the filtration system. One month I bought the two heaters that you see in there. And then, you know, my dad, he loves watching my videos so he was like i want to help you speed up the process so i'm gonna buy you a light and get that on there so you can get it going and you know and i'm not making these videos because i think i'm going to get thousands of subscribers and make money off of them this is just an extension of my hobby and i like to share what i'm doing you know i i have 10 subscribers and hey thank you guys because you 10 people are the only other 10 people besides myself and my dad that like to look at my videos you know, and, and listen to my conversations about my tanks, you know, because my wife has had it. She's like, I'm tired of your tank talk, talk, you know. So I'm now like, you know, this is a storage room under our stairs, you know, where I'm doing this. And over there, I've already got plans in the future. I want to do, uh, you know, like a 200 gallon all the way across that wall and do that. But I'm, I'm like really proud of it, you, you know, uh, super excited, you know. Um, I've done I've done a lot of research and hundreds and hundreds of hours, you know, on, on plants in particular, so I could do everything perfectly. And um, I do have three other tanks that are planted, 
um, I have had none die on me because I do, you know, I, I use a solid substrate um, uh, I, in conjunction with root tabs, fertilizers. I make sure they have proper lighting. Um, you know, it's just, there, there's a lot. If you have any questions, you know, please ask, you know, if, if, if you're curious as to how something went, just put it in the comments below. I will respond to everybody because I can talk tanks all day. You know, so just simply ask and uh, I'll, uh, you know, I'll tell you about it. But um, for the 10 subscribers that I, I have, thank you because you give me someone, at least someone to talk to about, about you know, the stuff that I love doing in my free time. So, um, you know, it, it, it gives me purpose besides my own children. You know, my, my two boys, you know, I love them. And then when I'm home all day by myself... I get to wander around the house and check tanks, the parameters, and test the water, you know, and all that, and make sure everything looks good, and I'll be doing another update whenever, uh, you know, in a couple months when this fills in, and I'm going to start loading it up with some fish. I got a few ideas. I won't spit those out now, but once again, thank you so much. My hair's all jacked up. I really don't care. I woke up early. It doesn't matter to me what I look like right now. I just, I'm happy everything was a success, and the, you know, and the plants are doing great and I didn't have to replant anything. And, um, I'm super confident that, you know, this is going to go exactly as planned. Um, uh, thanks again, anyone on YouTube or Reddit or whoever. And, uh, again, to the 10 random subscribers, I don't know you have never met you, but thank you again. Um, anyway, that's it. Have a great day.